I'm Rob Cardwell. Here's some of the day's top stories. Chesterfield police are investigating a shooting that happened just hours ago near Virginia State University that injured a 15 year old. Officials say they received the call around 12 10 a.m. and found that several vehicles had been struck by gunfire along the 21,000 block of 2nd Avenue. As they were investigating, they confirmed a 15 year old was taken to the hospital with non life threatening injuries. If you have any information that can help police, you're asked to call Crime Solvers. Their number on your screen there, 7480660. A Richmond judge has issued a stay regarding the convictions of a young man found guilty of a deadly graduation day shooting. This comes one day after Amari Pollard's lawyer filed a motion asking that Pollard be allowed to withdraw his guilty plea and get a new trial. Lead attorney Jason Anthony effectively claims that he failed Pollard and did not offer him proper legal advice after the judge told the jury not to consider their self-defense argument. In court Tuesday, Judge William Merchant said that a hearing in May will now decide whether Pollard can withdraw his guilty plea. He also issued a new gag order so that neither prosecutors nor defense attorneys can discuss the case publicly. And now here's Julie. And we're tracking a warm afternoon, upper 70s for that daytime high, right around 73 for Louisa Orange, 74 for Culpepper, and tonight not as chilly either. We've got upper 50s to low 60s underneath mostly cloudy skies. Rain chances will be elevated today, but really more widespread through the day on Thursday before winding down Friday and giving us a nice dry weekend so far. So we're looking at pretty good sky conditions for Saturday and Sunday. We do have a marginal risk of some severe weather for all the areas highlighted in green, so it gets a little bit riskier as we go westward right around the Ohio River Valley in terms of some potent storms there, but can't roll out a few showers and thunderstorms for the day tomorrow. Looking at that timeline, you'll notice it'll be overspreading during the afternoon. Your 70 forecast is next.